So the new Shogun adaptation just made history with a record 18 Emmy wins. And this would make it the first non-English language show to win Best Drama. While also the stars Hiroyuki Sanada and Anna Sawai are the first Japanese actors to ever win Emmys. And just going into the evening, the series already held a record for the most wins by any show in a single year. Having bagged 18 trophies at the Creative Arts Emmys just a week ago. But the show also won an additional 4 awards. This includes the top categories of Best Drama Series, and also Best Drama Directing for Frederick E. O. Toy, Best Actress in a Drama Series for Anna Sawai, and my favorite, Best Actor in a Drama Series for Hiroyuki Sanada. So, I don't normally care for award shows. This goes for Emmys, Grammys, Oscars, whatever else they have. Usually they're just looking for a certain message and that usually wins. But I will say that it is different when something like say Shogun or even Godzilla Minus One wins. Because that really doesn't happen often. But it's good because for one it means that the West is finally acknowledging Asian cinema. And also that in turn we may be getting more content. The fact that Shogun did so well could mean that we'll be getting more access to samurai shows and movies. And we're actually starting to see that already happening. We have the new samurai film Eleven Rebels and it's going to be brought to North America. And it was all just because of the success of Shogun. So even if you didn't like the new Shogun adaptation, this is still good news for you and everyone because we'll be getting more content. And I gotta say, it was pretty great just seeing Hiroyuki Sanada just finally winning something. You know, he's just such a legendary actor, and he's just done such an incredible job just for years. He's been in some of my favorite movies of all time, and I've just always been a fan of him. And him speaking backstage at the Emmys, he said that when he arrived on stage to accept his award, he said that he felt the weight of the moment, and what it all means historically. And Sonata really is Japan's top actor, and he's also one of the few to cross over to Hollywood in just a major way. He's in a ton of films. He began performing in Tokyo almost 60 years ago, and this was back when he was a child actor. And he was an apprentice under the legend Sonny Chiba. He also stated that his best actor win made him think about all his peers and teachers who have taught him since he was a child. Sonata also added that as far as the next generation, he hopes to see a lot of meaning in their nominations and wins. And just understand that they created a period Japanese series that really connected with the world. And this is also just a big win for FX and everyone who was involved with the series. It was a very expensive show to make and it also took almost 10 years. So for a long time it didn't even look like it was going to happen. And it's just great to see all that hard work pay off for something. So this is just a major win for Asian cinema. So hopefully we see more of this. So again, whether or not you like the show, this is just good news for everyone. And hopefully this does mean that we'll be getting plenty of more samurai content. You know, it's great for the channel too, and it's great for you guys. So, good things are up ahead. You know, stay positive. And like always, thanks for watching.